You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. July 27th marked the one-year anniversary of the flood that devastated much of eastern Kentucky. Mountaintop sat down with Pike County Emergency Management Director Nee Jackson to talk about the year's flood relief efforts and how the county is doing now. A lot of things have transpired and a lot of things have changed. Uh, thankfully here in Pike County, uh, we didn't have any fatalities. Uh, that's, uh, that's probably the biggest blessing that we've gotten from all of it. Our uh, Pike County uh, Long-Term Recovery Committee, which is Pike County Rel Relief Services, has uh, done a phenomenal job in helping folks try to recover uh, from the flooding. Some families in the county are still displaced and many are still repairing their homes. One positive aspect of the flooding was the connections made by those in the community determined to help those affected by the damaging waters. Although there's a lot of folks that are hurting, uh, a lot that has uh, been negative with it, there are some positives that has come about uh, through a lot of people networking, getting together, uh, pooling their resources and the biggest thing is maximizing our resources to make sure that we can take care of survivors, you know, even a year later and however long it takes to, uh, to get them back on their feet. Like most of eastern Kentucky, the communities affected by the flooding throughout Pike County are still recovering and will continue to recover for months or even years to come. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.